Your voice, your voice, your vote. Uh, we hear so much about what's happening on the campaign trail tonight. A firsthand perspective from the Green Party presidential candidate. Justin Zara sits down with Howard Hawkins to talk about campaigning during this pandemic and how he hopes to get to Washington. Republican Donald Trump, Democrat Joe Biden, Green Party candidate Howie Hawkins. You might not have heard the name Howie Hawkins or seen his face, but he is running for president on the Green Party ticket. He talked to us from his campaign office in New York. It's basically empty now because of the pandemic. This is a total disaster. And, you know, I think Trump is, a, you know, incompetent, doesn't care about us. It's all about him. But where the hell is Joe Biden? You know, he lives within commuter distance of the White House press corps. He could convene news conferences with them, like Andrew Cuomo did to Governor of New York early in the pandemic, and explain what we need to do, test, trace, and isolate the infected. Hawkins has a lot of ideas if he becomes president, but getting Green Party politics to the voters is the challenge. According to the latest finance summary from the Federal Election Commission, which ended in June, contribution to President Trump's campaign topped $154 million, Joe Biden $278 million, Howie Hawkins $214,000. You got to compete at the grassroots. Our people got to go out and talk to voters, convince them to vote for us. We're online, we're doing the social media. That's more of a level playing field. Hawkins supports defunding police and drastically cutting funds to the country's military. We're saying 75 percent to the people's needs and protecting the environment. We don't need to have a global military empire with 800 foreign military bases. Hawkins says the money taken from the military would go to humanitarian programs in the United States and abroad, providing things like vaccines and clean water. So we want to spend less on the military, and let's be the world's humanitarian superpower. Hawkins believes the United States should be taking a different approach when it comes to dealing with other countries, making friends, not enemies. I think what we need to do is have peace initiatives to reduce tensions, cut back on military spending, bring our troops home from these endless wars, pledge no first use of nuclear weapons. We have them as a deterrent. Why can't we say we're not gonna you know, nuke you first? Hawkins says the Green Party has about 250,000 registered members. They've seen a bump in supporters after Bernie Sanders dropped out of the race. But will it be enough to win the presidency? We run, the, the winning is not just winning the office. Winning is advancing issues and making the two major parties deal with our demands. Justin Pazera, ABC 15, Arizona. Primary is this Tuesday, August 4th, and as we count down to Election Day, ABC 15 has three promises for you. We will give you a voice, we will give you the facts, and we will cut through the noise to help you make informed decisions.